I feel like it's not gonna be very friendly, but. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today we actually have an unboxing. Now I did not order anything, but apparently one of you guys contacted Tom Patterson and wanted to send me something. So it just arrived. I have no idea what it is, but I thought I would go ahead and make a video for whoever decided to send it to me. I, I don't know, so I guess let's just get right into it. <laughs> All right, so here we go. So I'm hoping that it's not anything very mean. I don't know. Aw, it's a bat. Tom, did you do this intentionally? I love bats, they're like my favorite animal. I feel like that was intentional. <laughs> it's so cute. And a very nice warm heat pack, which is important. Yesterday it was 75 degrees. Today, it I'm not even joking right now, it is snowing. It's not sticking, but it's definitely snowing. It's normally like 70s and maybe even 80s at this point, so I don't understand what's up. But Tom was prepared nice and warm. Whatever is in here should be cozy and yeah. All right, what could this be? All this paper and all this for this little, this little enclosure. I don't know, it must be something pretty cool for, for all this, just for this one little tarantula. Oh my God. Love the Black Widow Scarlet. Hello my beautiful lovelies and welcome back to my channel, The Black Widow here. Oh my God, I was not expecting this to be somebody I know. Scarlet, oh my God, honey, stop, no. Her and I go way back. Like when I was first starting out, she started like shortly after. There we go, what a pretty girl. You need to check out her YouTube. I will link it down below. Oh my God, I, and honestly, the fact that it came from you, Scarlett, makes it even more exciting. And I'm, this is so cool. So this is a Therophosa apothesis. Now I am not as familiar with this genus. As you guys know, I just got Zelda my tea Sturmy, but this is the same genus and this looks like a captive bread sling, which is really cool. I have a few tarantula cribs enclosures that are empty right now, so I'm going to go dig in my closet really quick, but probably before we do that, maybe we should just kind of pop the lid off. Oh, I don't have my tongs though. That's, that's a little dangerous to go poking around without tongs, but... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how well you guys can see that. I see some feet. Okay, yeah, so this, oh my God. Oh, so it has pink feet. The common name I think is like pink foot something. I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, let me go find an enclosure for it and we can get a better look and set this up. Scarlet, oh my God. Okay, so I got all my supplies together and we're gonna make it a nice enclosure. Because it is a Therophosa species, these do tend to grow a little bit more rapidly than other genus, which means I'm actually going to size up on its enclosure than I normally would for a sling this size, just so it has plenty of room to grow for a while. I actually have this. It is a tarantula cribs. I think this is the medium terrestrial one. I think this will be perfect for it. These holes are pretty small, so um, I did see its foot. We did look at its foot and its foot looked to be, maybe its foot could slip out, but I, I don't think it'd go beyond that. So hopefully not. <laughs> we'll, we'll have to take a better look when it comes out, but let's go ahead and set up this enclosure. Okay. I wish I knew what happened to like, oh my cup. I need a cup. Where's the cup? It's not gonna be big enough. I need a cup, I need a cup. Got a cup, got a cup, got a cup. 
Okay, I found a cup. Much easier than just trying to dump it from the bag. Now, I'm not sure if these are very big burrowers. I feel like they will burrow as slings just because even like arboreal species tend to burrow when they're this small, but like I said, I'm like super new to this genus. See, lots of substrate. Yeah. I notice sometimes I'm really bad about showing enclosures from the side, so you guys don't realize like how much substrate's in there, but there's a lot. The moss. Oh, that was a lot of moss. I'll say that's excessive moss. Let's mix it in a little bit though. Still seems like a lot though, maybe we'll cut back a little bit. Of course we have our leaf litter. Mix that up a little bit as well. So I have cork bark and I also have this hide. I really like this hide. I think Tarantula Cribs actually gave me this as well. They do have like some accessories, but I thought, yes, this would be a nice little hide. Why not? Put a little bit more substrate over this to like half bury like the hides when I can. Oh yeah, that looks so cool. Okay, let's do a few more leaves. I think this is a pretty good Therifosa enclosure, but we do have one more thing we can add. Oh my God, there's still so many, like oh, there's so many. I love this blooming culture thing I got. It's like so, so many. Oh yeah, I need a water dish too, of course. Okay, I got it, <laughs> right there. So yeah, this enclosure should actually be like perfect. Cause we have a nice big hide for it. Lots of moss, springtails, leaf litter. Lots of substrate. So yeah, this is looking so cool. It's like a little cave, it's so cute. And it, it, I don't know, it all just looks really good. I really like it, but it doesn't matter what I think, it matters what the tarantula thinks. So let's just let this little one out and see if it likes its new home. I feel like it's not gonna be very friendly, but who knows? Oh, it's, oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh, okay. Very fast. Very, very fast. Yeah, I don't want you to fall. Whoa, that was very quick. I'm glad it was calm the first time we took a peek when I didn't have my tongs, because that could have been bad. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. It looks like it has little pink shoes on. Look at those hairs. What hairs? Pink feet, so cool. I almost wonder if it would eat for us. Like sometimes they're a little too freaked out when you first get them, but I don't know. This thing seems like it has a appetite. It's so bolty. Oh, like look at those movements. Oh my gosh, did it like kick hair? Look, oh my gosh. Very, very, very cautious right now. I love it. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, Scarlett. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. And we'll get to grow this one out from a sling, which is kind of cool. This makes my day, seriously. No, this like makes my week. It's so cool. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much, Scarlett, for this amazing new edition. <laughs> I love it, I love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you, Tom, for sending it and keeping it a secret. <laughs> anyway, like this video if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're not, and you want to be. Don't forget to go on Instagram, there's probably way too much, it's at tarantula.cat. You can go follow me there. I also have a Patreon podcast and a Teespring, and it's all linked down below. Don't forget to check out Scarlett. Also, we have a new podcast episode. It is up again down below and let's get into those patreon pet picks now